And ladies and gentlemen, the next game mode that is on the list is a game mode which is called Crazy. And uh, that's a game mode that probably no one of you knows unless you played the game yourself. Because this game mode only exists in this uh, in this game. In this game. Nowhere else this game mode exists. And yes, I did finish platform. On platform you can only get gold. There are no offer medals on platform. So yeah, let's go into a Crazy. Uh, so the way it works, um, we have like small maps. Like really small maps, mini maps. And um, we always have a target time that we have to beat. And we basically have to beat that multiple times in a row. And we, you, if I release, like you see, we play against multiple different ghosts. Like so many different. That's very crazy. And our goal is to always uh, not be in, not be uh, not be behind the last one. So it's a bit like the survival mode, you could say. And we have 16, we have 16 different levels, and we have to survive them all basically. And that's the goal. And our target time always gets better and better and better. And this map here is still really simple, but we also have some some really wicked maps, which kind of look like low maps. So it is a little bit like a knockout mode, but like a little more player friendly. Because you cannot immediately get knocked down. Ah, interesting. So can freeze actually an advantage because the ghosts only appear when they are a certain amount of ahead of you. Okay, can freeze superior. All right, and last level. First of all, we got gold. Oh. Oh, we finished. Okay. Wait, so there are no offer times or what? Ah, there are no offer times. Okay, well then. <laughs> oh no. We cannot even continue. Oh, that's so bad. We have. Oh, nee. We have to do the cups first, guys. Oh, on oh no. We have to do the cups before we can play crazy. Unless we, because we don't have the maps unlocked. Oh, scheiße. Yeah. So basically, for those of you that don't know, um, in the race and in the platform mode, you have those things called cups. Like, you can see them over here. And the way those works are, like, if I start a cup in this in this uh, yeah, challenge folder, then we have to beat the gold medal on all of those five maps, basically, in a row. And only then we will uh, finish it. We will unlock it. So we actually have to do that now, good to know. So yeah, we just have to quickly uh, do the cups, which I wanted to do at the ending originally. But I guess we do it now, unlucky. But yeah, fine for me. The race map should be easy, but the thing is we have to do it on platform. And getting uh, getting it on, oh, getting uh, gold on platform all the time in a row uh, is really difficult. Because for those of you that don't know, on platform, uh, you always need to finish the maps without respawning, and they sometimes are really, really difficult. So yeah. All right, first map done. Next challenge. So we quickly have to rush through here, basically. I think we need a really good speed here. Can we land all the way? Ah, easy. Zack. Ah, good. Okay, made it. Next one. <laughs> <Lois F. laughs> Alright, we got it though. Next cup. Done. Oh no, this... Okay, now it gets really crazy, guys. Now it really gets crazy because this map is hella fucked up. Now the boring, crazy maps are over. Now we have this kind of stuff. And that is indeed crazy. Oh no, the sign. Oh, God. <sighs> and this, uh, yeah. This can't go terribly wrong. Flat AOA, yeah, <laughs> kinda. Yeah, but I also don't say the the stunt thing was uh, exciting to watch. <laughs> Super subcore. Oh no 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 no! What? Nine. Are you serious? Wow, I actually failed the level because of that. Yeah, great. Amazing. We have to go again. Uh, a bit unnecessary. Ah! All those jumps now, man. Alright. One more or did we finish? Ah, yeah, we finished. Okay. Alright, next one done. And time to go to the next race cup, which is called Nightlife. Alright, there you go. Finished. Beat it by 21 seconds. Alright. 
Cup mode done. All right, the next cup in the pocket. And now uh, we have another crazy map which we're gonna play, which is called Forest Jump. I think this one was actually kind of tough. Yeah, you had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one was not too easy. This one also had a cut, like you can skip basically all of those ramps. But yeah, that's way too. Of course, that's way too dank. Ah! What the fuck, man? Yeah. Yeah. Very glorious run. Bro! Oh god. <laughs> That's not how it's supposed to look like. <laughs> like technically, you can also side jump like this a little. To land a little earlier. That's tough. Ah, then you just go diagonal. That's the regular route. God. <laughs> Wicked. Oh god. Yeah, great. Let's repeat that immediately. <laughs> yeah, but I think the 10k... Is oh, dude! I'm not learning out of mistakes! Yeah, forest jump better than forest climbing. True. Alright, we got the gold. No! Fuck. We have to restore it. No way, you son of a bitch, man. What is this? Oh, what? Do we have to do everything again? Are you actually serious? No, behind it, there's a the finish. You fucker. You little fucker, man. Oh, no. Dude, I hate this cup things. Because that stupid jump didn't work twice. All right, and there we go. Second last cup finished. All right, my low dead zone, but it did work. And I actually now understood quite nicely how stunt mode works. So that's not too bad. How many masters with wheel? Yeah, not many. <laughs> but often you don't need them. All right, we got the gold medal. Zack, and with that we finished the first out of two. Um, yeah, series. And the next series is called Circus. And in order to even unlock the maps, we have to finish more cups. And the bad thing about those cups is we unlock them by like we have to do the cups in the uh, yeah in the platform uh, in the platform game mode. And the platform maps once again they are meant to be extremely difficult. And uh, your only goal in the platform uh, game mode is to finish the map without respawning and we have to do we basically have to one shot every single map five times in a row so one shot one shot one shot one shot one shot and only then we get the gold cup and we have to do that for all of the five uh, series and this is exactly what could take a few ages honestly like this could literally take ages so huh, let's get in, yay! At least some of them. So yeah, could take some time, <laughs> but I'm somewhat ready. Oh, land bug! Dude, I got a land bug and I cannot even make it anymore. Yeah, come on! This map, ah, dude, what the fuck? And if something like this happens on the last map, I'm gonna be really mad. Like one thing that I always would have wished for a platform mode would be like to also have, uh, you know, like uh, an offer medal. Like the way, uh, like for example, um, in Trickmania 2, um, there exists the Trickmania 2 Alpine title pack, which is like basically a remake of the, amazing, of the snow environment. And for that, they also created um, a platform campaign at some point. And I actually drove the offer times for that. And the way they made it there, was um, that you had the regular uh, bronze, silver, gold, and then the offer time is zero respawns and beat a certain amount of time. So, like you have to be fast and without a mistake. And that's kind of cool, if you ask me. Then we're gonna go here. Suck. In the cage. Suck. All right. Now, I think here we have to release. Yeah. Ha. 
Are you actually serious? What the f- oh, man. <sighs> like, come on, man. Oh. And back to my one again. Yay. Woo. Okay. I have to quickly go camp 7. Because this jump here is a little bit of an asshole. Um, we have to land here, but we have to release a lot. Or what I did is I just full speeded, landed here and flipped down, but that's not really viable. So, yeah. Are we already- oh god, we're already here. Okay, just gonna release, 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 and... That's unfortunate. Oh, why is it? Th why is this the last map? Oh, this map is so bad. Oh, those two parts. Ay ay ay. Ah, scheiße. Failed. Yeah. Oh god, you immediately get the failed. Okay, I have to practice at one point. But this one is the easiest one together with map one. Because they all have, they are difficult, but they have like stuff you can control. Oh, I land booked! Are you serious? Wait, could, was it possible to save this? No! Fuck! Nein! Ah, but I cannot save this. Dude, only because of a land bug! Oh, fuck off, game. Seriously, fuck off. Because I land bugged. Oh, nee. Yeah, at least you can control stuff, by the way. XDD, man. Oh. Like, literally, doing five maps of this in a row is, like, hella tough, man. Alright. Now, the tough part. Oh, nee. Oh, god, that could be bad. Oh, shit, I still have... Oh, I hope I have enough speed. Because we have to land... I don't have enough speed. I have to break, I have to break, I have to break. And run is dead. Amazing. One eternity later. We got it! Let's go! Whew! That was very difficult as well. <laughs> oh, let's fucking go. We one shot all of the maps in this series. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the final platform cup, which is called Summit. And here we have only three maps, which is a good sign, uh, the good thing. But they're all difficult, that's the bad point. <laughs> so the first one is Tam Tam, which is by far the most difficult one, so it's good that this one is first. Then we have Goal, an island map, and Vertigo, a wicked uh, bay map. So my, I think it's smart, I'm quickly gonna practice Goal and Vertigo, and then we're gonna uh, go. I have to land on this road, yep. And now the ending, the ending is extremely tough. So we had to release here, go smooth, then land smooth in this, no, this one didn't land smooth, but here, we have to land smooth in this one. Otherwise, it looks like this and we cannot make it. So this was already too unsmooth. And this ending is like a big fucking asshole. Like, seriously. This is such a terrible end. Don't bug. Okay. Yeah. And GG, we got it. All right. We finished all of the platform cups. Overall, it went way quicker than I had expected, to be honest. Like, <laughs> the biggest struggle was, uh, was cup number three. This one. This one was the biggest struggle. The fucking coast maps, man. All right. Easy peasy. There you go. Now it looks like this in the overall campaign. And now we have the crazy mode left. Uh, only the very last map, which is called Bouncy Alley. Oh, this one. Oh, no. This one is stupid. 
Okay, this could be tough, depending on how fast Nadeo is here. Alright. Bit of a resident sleeper map for the last crazy map, but yeah. And to be honest, I think I didn't have a single ghost yet, which was slower than their fastest ghost. Total dominance. Ah, land pack! Whoa, but what a reaction. Easy. Okay. Last level. Okay, we still have enough time. As long as we don't bug now. Ah, I bugged. <laughs> but it's still fine. Alright, there you go. Oh, even the timer turned yellow. Oh. Alright, there you go. You finished the series with a gold ranking. You finished the campaign with a gold ranking. Woo. And with that, we finished the crazy mode. So we fin we entirely 100% finished race, platform, puzzles, stunts, and crazy. And now the last thing we have to do for the 100% in the game is the extreme race. And yeah, those are basically a set of bonus maps. We have bonus series 1 to 3. And in each series we have, uh, yeah, one X race. It's called the extreme race. And yeah, it's always one map of each environment. So this is just some regular driving again gonna be really easy uh, yeah so yeah ah I stood out oh shiver yeah not easy to beat when I drive like this fuck there's the AT okay I'm gonna snipe in the last turn watch it learn ha ah oh what a race Zack there you go <laughs> Monka <laughs> little bit closer than it had to be but we got it all right this map this map is very special to me this uh, I actually have the world record here and uh, I always loved this map as a kid. Like, I really, really love it. There are like some wicked cuts you can do. And some wicked tricksters. One of them is like to go here at the inside. That's what I always try to do as a kid, although it's not even faster. And then if you had enough speed, it was possible to jump over a bridge now. I don't know if I can do it now. It was possible to jump over this and I always felt like a giga chat when I made that. Thing is though, it's slower, <laughs> so you don't really wanna do it. Ooh. But I always loved doing that as a kid. Okay guys, can you tell me what is the sunrise world record on this map? I'm gonna beat it. World record by Rad, okay, okay. Yeah, the world record will be easy to beat by him, pretty sure. Just with, with the knowledge and skill from nowadays. Yay, I beat the 106.82. Woo! Did you Uber on Skid or Die? Of course, yeah. Alright, 104.64. And my world... I pussed it out, of course. So, yeah. But it's not my... Uh, it's not... It's not my... I mean, I beat the world record by two seconds now, technically. But it's not my world record from uh, United. My world record from United is 104.28. Should we try to beat that? Nine, you bitch, you son of a bitch. Enter, you asshole. Enter, just shut up, man. <laughs> no. Oh fuck. That would have been official world record, guys. Like out of even from Trackmania United. But I slid in the very last turn, of course. Enter, you don't write anything, Enter. And do you shut up? <laughs> Dude, that run was so good. <laughs> no, that could have been a sub almost. Surely I'm gonna finish. Dude, I always slide. I cannot do anything about it. Like, I go onto it and I slide. It's so stupid. Like, what should I do against that? Like, huh? I'm so confused. I feel like it's a dirt block. It always gives me a slide. Did I get a landing bug? Are you actually serious? Oh, not. Okay. Okay, didn't land. <laughs> All good guys. Still in an attempt. Oh god. 
All right, let's see. Now I slid before. That's bad as well. Ugh, I don't care, man. I take this now. Now, <laughs> now I slid before the actual booster. Dude, I'm such a troll. I cannot do the ending. But yeah, it is world record. So, uh... WR. Suck. It is the world record, so we're gonna save the replay. We're gonna upload it later. So technically, we improved the world record by 2.7 seconds. <laughs> And uh, the actual world record, which I held uh, in Trickmania United, I improved by 0.15 now. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna leave this map immediately and we go to X-Race 08 and somebody please check uh, the world record on this map. Somebody has to check it, please. 101.2 by Prof. Okay. Uh, and then here, the, these turns were so mean all of the time. Ah, uh, like, <laughs> honestly, this could already be it. <laughs> Here we also have to break at the tunnel entry, I think. Yeah, well. <laughs> First try beating world record by 1.6 seconds. Okay. You are safe to replay, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, 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 the sunrise records are bad. <laughs> they, they are really not good. Yeah, okay, landing smooth here clearly isn't worth it. <laughs> wait, let me wait. If I get if I improve my PB with that, it is the official world record in this game. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the official world record on this map has a 360. Yo, <laughs> uh, oh, XCD. Wait, I have to see that again. Uh, it was such a bad run. <laughs> like, the actual world record on Trackmania United still is a 57 point something. <laughs> way too dank. <laughs> Way too dank, way too dank, way too dank. Should we just take that and upload that? <laughs> <laughs> Coast car looks so good, yeah. But this is the bay car, my friend. <laughs> but Coast car also looks good, yeah. Yeah, you know what? We saved it, we just take it. We're gonna do the last map now of the entire game, basically. X-Race 09. Uh, this map is way too dank. It has a cut, though. Oh, we're not gonna go for it. We're gonna beat it legit way. So this is a chroma map. Because this is hella full speed. Wait, why did I, I just tried to speed slide on island? Fuck. Top 10 signs that you became a stadium player. I just tried to speed slide wiggle. <laughs> okay. uh. But island full speed maps are kinda dank. There's a small cut that you can do here. You can just take this as a quarter pipe jump instead of uh, the yeah the, the looping things. Can we backslide here? Wow. <laughs> yes, <laughs> we can. <laughs> I don't think it was that fast. Yeah, we have no speed, but. Wicked, it, it still was wicked. Oh, and the finish jump here is way too dank. Oh god. Yeah, the finish. It had this finish. The finish is way too dank. You go to Oh no, I'm gonna miss it. And then water bounce. Uh, nine! Alright, let's get it now. And if we finish this with the offer medal, we finished Trackmania. It's unfortunate. Here also had a good line. Ah, Scheiße, come here, man. Come here. Ha! 
Okay. Aim the finish. Alright. And with that, in case we don't miss the finish, which would be great. Oh, I almost missed it. <laughs> and with that, ladies and gentlemen, we got the very last offer medal of the game. And with that, we finished the whole game on 100 fucking percent. This is how it's supposed to look like when you get it done. Whew. Holy moly 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 moly. That was way too wicked. But, uh, yeah. Can you do a serious count? Uh, oh. Ah, fuck. Oh, we have the series. Oh, nee. Okay, well then, take all the, take all of the claps back. We still have the cups here. <laughs> okay. Well then, we still gotta do them real quick. <laughs> I'm just gonna one-shot everything now, hopefully. Oh, great. Ah, scheiße. But there is, there is more content. All right, we go for the cut here, of course, because, uh, yeah. Ah! Oh, oh. oh, no. Here we go again. <laughs> Fuck. Oh man, why am I like this? We go for the cut here, of course. <laughs> yeah, XCD man. Surely I'm gonna miss the finish. But now, ladies and gentlemen, we even pp'd with that. <laughs> we finished Trackmania Sunrise Extreme on 100%. But uh, there are, as I said, more Nadeo maps. And when you have the game, you can find them by going to single challenges. So like where you just play the maps you have on your PC. Then you go to uh, campaigns. And then you will find this extra folder here with Nadeo maps. And no, never mind. We go to challenges and then to Nadeo. And then we have the bonus tracks. <laughs> I uh, bamboozled that a little bit. So we have a bonus tracks. Uh, we have bonus tracks with four new entire folders of maps with eight maps each. Um, wait, what? Huh? Uh, yeah, exactly. And we're gonna play through all of them. We have like uh, 16 normal maps and also 16 um, rather short, um, yeah, multi lab maps. And I don't know why they didn't make didn't make it to the actual solo mode and why they're only hidden here, but. I mean, it is kind of cool solo maps. Maybe they also came in with the extreme add-on. I have no idea. But they are in the game, and we're going to get all of the ATs on that. And yeah, exactly. So yeah, um, we're going to hop straight in. Six, uh, tw Dude, 32 maps is quite a bit, but it shouldn't take too long, honestly. Uh, because the ATs are going to be easy. It's only regular races, so like no stunting stuff or stuff like that. So yeah. We're going to hop onto, first, onto the first map, which is called Anaconda. And, uh, yeah, let's just play it and get the AT and let's see how long this will take. If I'm good, we could maybe one-shot every single map, kinda. <laughs> because it really isn't that tough. This map, I think, even has a shortcut a little bit, or, like, something. Like, something you could call a shortcut. But we don't really need that. You can basically kinda skip the last little thing. Wait, still double chat? Dude. XCD, man. Okay, now it's fixed. So yeah, first AT in the pocket. The the offer times on the regular race maps really are not difficult to beat. Like, they really aren't. At least when you know the map, sort of, and when you know how to play the game, it's pretty easy. Alright, this map though, this map, if I remember correctly, has a bug slide. And I'm of course the best bug slide player in the entire game, so I will do the bug slide. I think it's here. Zack! What just happened? Huh? <laughs> okay, that wait, wait, what just happened? Huh? <laughs> what was that box slide? I just slid into the wall, my car flipped and like, huh? Like, <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> huh? Wait. Alright, come on, next attempt. Zack? But no. Great box slide. Absolutely perfect. But yeah, some of those, uh, like all of the Nadeo maps here, they are relatively short. But they honestly all are kind of cool. Zack! Scheiße. Man, I wanna do it with the backslide. Yes. They feel like exactly the same, honestly. So I really shouldn't struggle, but I still struggle. Dude, what am I doing? Okay, maybe it's still enough. That was not the best exit ever. 
but maybe it will be enough. With enough copium, we can make it, surely. Yo, McChigwit, hello. Ah, oh, just give me AT, man. Give me, give me, give me. Ah, wonderful. All right, we got it. Next Done. one. Bit now, clean landing. Oh, this map is really cool. This map is really, really, really cool. Because this map is all about getting clean landings, but I think it also has a shortcut. If I remember correctly. So, like, technically your goal is to do, like, smooth jumps. And they're actually kind of nicely calculated, so they are... Okay, the first one is not smooth at all. Yeah, okay, never mind. I take it back. Nadeo, what doing? XDD. Okay, I think... So, I think it's mainly about releasing here. But this map is actually teaching something really important, which is, uh, yeah, getting clean landings in order to keep more speed. So, pretty, pretty good map, actually. Alright, is that already enough? I think so. Should be, should be. Yes. And I think the shortcut is um, to like flip out of here and land here and just skip the jump basically. But it's so difficult and it barely saves anything. So not gonna go for that. That's for sure. I don't know if it is in... Yeah, yeah. It might be this one. Ach, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. First of all, loop and roof. And this map also has a shortcut. I'm pretty sure. I think, wait, isn't even, I think Schmaniol even has the world record here. But it's basically possible to like flip out here and skip the looping with that. But it's way too dang. So I'm just not gonna do that. <laughs> it's a bit too difficult for me. Not the type of cut that I like. But that's basically the entire map. Like a looping and a very unsmooth jump and that's about it. <laughs> Amazing. Creative mapping once again. Zack, zack. Oh god. Easy. Okay, that's a bit... <laughs> Once again, nice mapping, Nadeo. Good job. How is that off a medal? How? How is Nadeo playing? Like... Okay, I take it though. Now it's time for Kangaroo. Oh, this map? This map has a shortcut, guys. This map has a shortcut that I can do as well. Let me first of all go normal. The normal route, you just go here, and then you land in here, and like a kangaroo, you jump out again, basically. That's the regular route. I think usually you probably want to release here to get like smoother landings. But there's a shortcut. There is a shortcut. And we, maybe, yeah, we can get the AT with it. So, what you have to do is, you have to climb out here. And then you go for a CD trip. We go here, here, here. And then we have to break here to go... Scheiße. <laughs> Not like this, but to go here. And then we finish there. And if you do it fast enough, it is faster. So I'm gonna try to get a team with it. I never really did the cut myself. I only know it from um, from world records. But you can really, really risk that one turn there. But it's super tough. Zack, zack. Ha! There you go. Shortcut FWO in the chat. There you go. Zack. Got Nadeo medal. Pretty oh, and this one, this one also has a nice trickster. It's super stupid. This map has a trickster which Nadeo will not be too happy about. So the normal way is just to drive like this. Zack, 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 zack. Then optimally don't slide out. And then uh, you go into the finish. So, like, super simple map. But, how's that Nadeo medal? <laughs> but there is a trickster here that you can do. And the trickster is... To basically go normal and then it is actually faster to fully yolo this and then to wall bank here to get a slowdown and a better angle so don't tell nadeo they will probably ban me from tmgl but it is indeed faster a little bit it saves like half a tenth maybe but like on a short map like this that's quite a bit so yeah interesting trick we go next dude we had roman rune we had rune by night now we have rune of the sun Oh, this map. This map is also way too dank. I always hated this one, I think. I don't even know why. Alright, we drop. It's kind of a nice off-road map. Okay, where do we go? Here? Uh, ah! Yeah, I think I took the wrong route. Alright. Is that it? Nah, that's not enough. Or... Oh, we got it, actually. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. Yeah, I never was a fan of this map as a kid. I, I don't know. I just didn't feel this one. Next to right. Vulcan Harbor. Oh, this map. This map actually, uh, fun fact, this one just saw a new world record literally yesterday. Because um, there was a task being done on this map. 
And the Taz um, found a new trickster here. I'm not sure if I can show it off to you because I think it's somewhat difficult to do. But the normal route is just to get like a lot of speed out of that. Then you jump here. You get this. And then you just like kind of PF into the finish, right? And uh, Star Root, I don't know if he's still in the chat, but he was earlier. There basically is a trickster where if you get it clean, you can, uh, at the jump through the hole, you can clip one of those edges from underneath, like probably this or so. And if you do it correctly, it pushes you down a little and you reduce some airtime. So let me maybe, uh, let me get the world record real quick. Because I literally just watched it before the stream. <laughs> it's like brand new out of the oven. Here, here you have it. One hour ago, Vulcan Harbor by Starwood. Here you can see the trickster. So first of all here, fast start of course. Wanna keep as much speed as possible. And then here, look. Zack! And that small uh, reduction of airtime actually gained him like, yeah, 0.15 almost. It's like way too dank. It, and it's like so funny, like people find tricks, uh, tricks on 15 year old maps. I mean, of course, Trackmania Sunrise maps have never been played as much as um, like Nations Forever maps, for example. But it's still impressive. But yeah, with that, we finished the micro tracks with all ATs. And now it's time for some multi lap action. We have mini laps. And also micro laps. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna start with mini laps and with Code de Sur. Or however, you pronounce that, I have no idea. Dude, the map, the folder is called mini maps, and now I see a one minute plus map. Nadeo, interesting definition of mini. Wait, can we wall ride this? Zack. Surely. It gives you. Like, wall riding in Coast is so overpowered sometimes because the car is so slow and sloppy, it's like. You know, it barely wants to steer, and sometimes, it's, or like quite often, it's just faster to slam yourself into the wall. Oh, and finito! There you go! Zack, zack! Got it! Next one, Crazy Bridge. Oh, this map, this map, okay. On this map, we have to watch the world record, because it's way, t it's, it's so stupid. It's so stupid. Uh, we're gonna have, oh, no, no, not the world record, I mean the, the task. Because there is actually, uh, there's one person who's called Kimura. Maybe some of you he heard of him before. He's doing a lot of tasks, amazing turn, uh, for Trackmania Sunrise maps. And dude, on this map, it's way too dank. Like, it really is way too dank. We're gonna watch it. So this one is another six seconds faster. And 13 seconds faster than the RTA. All right, this one is even newer because I think this one now, is not only doing regular bug slides, um, they're doing something in Ireland which is called um, teleport bug slide. So you can basically bug slide in Ireland, but it's like so quick, uh, it's kind of it kind of looks like teleporting. You will see it. It's like way too dank. Or I, at least I hope he's doing it. Let's see. Here, Zack, do you see those super quick movements? It's like teleports. And on some maps, it's like absolutely crazy. Here, Zack. <laughs> Like, it's way too dank. Look at he's backsliding the whole map. Zack, zack, zack. You have like those super spiky fast movements and... Like, you can do it literally everywhere, it feels like. Zack, boom. <laughs> it's way too dank, way too dank. It's crazy. It's not even really backsliding. Like, he's landing sideways and is immediately going into the other direction. Like, look at this. It's so crazy. Zack. <laughs> Like, he literally backslid every single corner of the map except for the very first one. Like, it's crazy. It's crazy. So technically, the island environment is like... So basically, the teleport backslide on island is like the nose boost on stadium. Like, you cannot really... You, I mean, you can kind of do it in RTA, at least in some runs, on some maps. But it's not as viable as it looks like. Like, it's crazy. My WR got beaten by 1.5 seconds? Wait, really? Wait, look, by Star Root! Dude, Star Root, I'm gonna time you out. <laughs> look, previous 58.14 by me, and now it's 56. Because I think Star Root is doing uh, the bug slide. I think he's doing the bug slide, right? Yeah, 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 look, look, look. Oh, he even does the teleport things. Like, he literally Double did the teleport things uh, on an RTA. It's like XTD, man. It's, yeah, I don't know. I never understood how that works. But technically, you can do that on, it feels like every single island map. It's crazy. It's really similar to the nose boost of how it can be abused. It's crazy. But yeah, 
We got the 80. I'm happy with that. We go next and the next. Ah! Nateo! I'm on the checkpoint. Dude. <sighs> Nateo mapping in a nutshell. I love it. Dude, I, 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 I saw it so early and I full braked and it still wasn't enough. Alright, got it. Next one. Or oh, did we finish? Okay, we finished the series actually. Alright. So we only have, um, the only thing we have left is micro laps, which is, which are once again multi-lap maps, but they are shorter, I think. And the first one is called Shopping Center. Okay. Alright, I remember this map, because this jump here is absolutely badly calculated, because you overjump it by so much, once again. And Hazer Fraser with the tier 1 sub, thank you! A new sub, pork job. Thanks a lot. Dark, Next no, one. night round. I'll, oh yeah, this map is also, uh, yeah. I mean, it's basically even more of an O than the previous map. We can, of course, do the bug slides here. And here it's like, I think I think this one also had like a really crazy task. Yeah, here we have the task. Yeah, 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 yeah. Three months ago. By Kimura once again. And it's 19 seconds. So instead of 30 seconds, 19. So let's just watch. So first turn, just full inside, of course. But then here, the bug slide begins. Zack! And once again, he does the DP TP bug slides. It's... Yeah. Giga wicked. Zack, 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 you're so fast. And you... And even a cut... <laughs> Wait, what was that ending? He even does a cut. And the bug finish, dude. What the fuck? Zack, zack, zack. Way too dank. Way too dank. That is uh, really fast. <laughs> So, like, it's such a simple 30 seconds map, and he cuts it down to 20 seconds with, like, bug slides, a cut, and whatever. Like, holy shit. Got it. Right, next one, Crazy 8. And Crazy 8 has one hell of a reroute. One hell of a reroute. And then and in the second lap, you can do a different kind of the shortcut. Because you have more speed. It's, like, way too dank. So, I hope I can hit it now. Okay, that's not too fast, but let's just continue. So, you go like this, zack. Then onto here. Already two seconds saved. And then in the second lap, you can jump from here immediately over here. But if you have enough speed, then you can make the jump that I tried to do first. So like from here, all the way here. And suck, and suck, and suck, and we save like five seconds. Easy. Not so easy to be honest, but kind of a cool reroute. And there you go. All right, see you soon. <laughs> it's actually kind of a nice name for the last map. And it's gonna be the very last map we will play in Trickmania Sunrise, guys. And yeah, then we fully finish the game. Literally every single map that exists in the game, finished. There technically there still are community campaigns you can play, but for me, sadly, the download doesn't work. But I mean, playing all of them would take another few days, so... The game is really, really, really offering a lot. Okay, so a nice, relaxing coast map to end the game for us. But what a journey it was. This one definitely is probably also the hardest game to finish. At least when you count out turbo SCMs. So yeah, pretty cool game. Amazing. <laughs> but we got it. We finished all of the offer times. There you go. Zack, AT in the pocket. And with that, we finished all of the bonus tracks that we have as well. As well as the entire solo mode. And yeah, now it's sadly time to say bye-bye to Trickmania Sunrise. The second ever uh, Trickmania game to release. At least the second full Trickmania game. Uh, which implemented a few new things. Like we had three entirely new environments, new game modes. A lot of stuff to do, but uh, we got it all. And with that, we are finally done with Trackmania Sunrise Extreme. In my opinion, a really great game you can spend hundreds of hours in, and even nowadays, it looks super, super good. So I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. The next game on the list is Trackmania Nations ESWC from 2006, of which the highlight video will be released soon. Until then, have a nice day, guys! I will live on, I 
will live. I will.